Hello and welcome to Grace Christian School. My name is Cindy Phillips and I am head of school here at Grace. We are a preschool through eighth grade school on the east side of Columbus in Blacklick, Ohio. We are so grateful that you are taking some time today to learn a little bit more about Grace and who we are. First and foremost, God is at the center of everything that we do. I think it's pretty clear. Um, Proverbs has a lot of lessons, a lot of teaching about uh, raising children, uh, particularly Proverbs 22, 6 uh, speaks to uh, training up a child in the ways that they should go. Uh, when they get older, uh, they won't depart from it. So as parents, um, we actually realized the need to have more reinforcement around how our children were raised. And that was a big driver as to why we chose Grace as the school uh, for our children to attend. For me, it is so important that home, school, and church, all three of those point our children to Christ. Probably one of the best things I've seen out of our kids is now when they come home or we'll see, we'll turn on music and they're instantly like praising and worshiping God. Their hands are in the air or if something happens, you're like, well, let's pray about that. And I'm like, <laughs> okay, let's pray about that. We've talked about it, but when you see other kids your age acting in a certain way and that's their answer to things, I'm like, okay, they're getting something. Jesus died on the cross for and then he rose again for three days. For me, you, you, me, me. I remember one time Maxwell came home um, and he wanted to worship. He has never <laughs> said the word worship to me before. Now we actually worship much more often than we did before because our child was the one who came to us and said, I want to worship and here's the exact song that I want to use. And also just their faith. Their faith is building. We can see it every, every single day. Um, we went from having bedtime prayers, which were pretty you know, bland uh, to them actually believing in the power of prayer. And, you know, we have personal testimony that our children's prayers have, have definitely uh, became reality uh, in our household uh, because of their faith. What I love about God is I get to talk to Him whenever I want and when I'm having trouble with something, He's always there for me and He's always there for everyone else. Each morning when we go to Bible class, um, it just kind of is like getting me more deeper in the gospel and it just teaches me more about Christ and I kind of just want to keep learning more and more so I can have wisdom in Him. Especially in our older students, there's a lot of um, just questions about who they are and are they accepted and are they loved and is something wrong with them. And being at GCS, I get to remind them of the truths of Scripture and what God says about them. As well as receiving a faith-based education, students at Grace Christian School are extremely well prepared for high school. Having an educational background, just knowing the expectations of what needs to be taught, what levels of academics need to be presented to the kids, I was very impressed with what was offered here at Grace Christian. Two of my favorite classes, which are also the most challenging, or actually three, is geometry, chemistry, and English. Mrs. Eads is the um, science teacher, and I remember we were learning to balance ke um, chemistry e equations. It was getting really difficult, and she would all um, she would help all of us individually so that we would understand it. For science specifically, students are engaged in earth science, space science. We go through biology, life sciences, even human anatomy and physiology. By the time they leave eighth grade, they have received education in physics and chemistry. And many of my students who have graduated and come back and told me about their science curriculum in high school have told me that they were the most prepared students in their classes and that they were pretty much in a review for most of their high school curriculum. So when I do good and when I work hard, it's glorifying God. I got to compete in the spelling bee and I won two times. It taught me that when, when we work hard, it's worth it. I love learning my ABCs and my numbers. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, E. Not only is it amazing academically, not only is it, you know, inspired our kids to have more faith into God, but it's also so much fun. I have so many friends at school. 
Brendan, Brendan Ellington, Naomi Chris, Allie White, Jaime Lopez. Everything we do is rooted in scripture and what God, how God calls us to live as followers of Christ. And at the same time, it's a school where the students compete in all the sports. And we have school dances, we have uh, school trips like other schools do. So the school has a, a rooted core values that they don't compromise on, and yet the experience the students have is like regular school. As a family who is diverse in our own way, it was so important that we attended a school where our uh, children would see people who look like their mom or look like their dad or look like themselves. To teach here and to look around my classrooms in every single class and see such a great variety of cultures, ethnicities, and the students being able to interact with each other and learn about each other and learn from each other has been just an amazing experience. On Heritage Day, we um, sometimes Ms. Phillips has a couple people come up and they get to share their culture and they get to speak in different languages and sometimes we have people speaking that are from different countries or states and it's really fun to just to see all the different cultures. I have a friend that's a girl that her name is Adina and she, and she is from Ethiopia and she has the same skin color as me but she is not, she does not look like me at all. I love that mm -hmm. for our kids that they are in a diverse world. It's such a loving environment and they can be in a classroom where everyone doesn't look like them. Being able to have nearly 30 countries represented in those families and to learn from one another and to see um, just the diversity and how that reflects God's kingdom and have that here, it's just like a little slice of heaven. Kids these days are very, very isolated. Um, and one of the great things about GCS is that they're not isolated while they're here. They're seen and they're loved while they're here. My favorite part about going to school here is the relationship between the teacher and the student. Because of the smaller class sizes and just the heart that these teachers have for the students, they're able to meet each kid where they are and just watch them and help them grow into the student that they're supposed to be. The thing I've loved the most is after I've, I've taught them for three years, or most of them for three years, is to see them, each of them uniquely nearly 400 students. I can tell you any student's name. Uh, you know, if they walk by, I know their name. I know their parents' names. I would recognize them in the grocery store. Planning and looking for a place that will nourish your child spiritually, uh, will make sure that your child's being accepted socially, and, and we also challenge your child academically. Uh, GCS is the right place because we have witnessed in our own lives, in our own kids, how all those three areas has been well uh, kept and then achieved. When I think about the investment that we're making our children by sending them to Grace, not just the financial investment, but even the time that we invest, um, investing in their walk with Christ, um, there's no better investment, I believe, that we could be making at such a fundamental time in their lives. Thank you again for taking time to learn a little bit more about Grace and who we are. I hope that I have the privilege of meeting you and your children someday. I hope that you will take the time to come in and have a tour of Grace Christian School, meet our teachers, meet our students, meet everyone here on campus and really have a tour of our buildings and our 20 acre campus that is an amazing place to learn. So uh, as, a, as a parent that is looking for a place where you know that we are going to stand firmly on the Word of God, the truth in our lives, and learn about what that relationship with Jesus Christ looks like. We hope that you will consider Grace Christian School as the place to send your child. Thank you.